Hello, beautiful manifesting generator. Today I'm channeling for you a love message and I definitely recommend, recommend listening to the generator love message. It is so beautiful. So, 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 so beautiful. So, so potent and yeah. So definitely check that out and you can apply this message to a relationship thing that you have going on right now, whether it's romantic or friendship or otherwise, and also just about your own capacity to give and receive love. So apply the message as you see fit as applies to your life right now. And yeah, this is working with you on an energetic level. So Make sure you have an inner yes to receiving this transmission and working with, with me and my direct connection with God and your energy field. So manifesting generator. So go ahead and just sitting right now, find a beautiful tall spine and feeling solid in your core. So there's like a drawing in of your core and an opening in your chest. This is the kind of posture that, you know, elite athletes would have or celebrities dancers. It's an exalted posture. And it's one where you're just holding yourself in high esteem. And that is the real essence of today's message or transmission is that you, you deserve to hold yourself in high esteem. You're meant to hold yourself in high esteem. You're meant to embody self-respect. You're meant to respect your wishes, your desires, your longings. You're meant to respect your ideas and your creations. You're meant to respect your energy and your time and your money. You're meant to respect yourself in all ways and to hold yourself in high regard. And you may have had a tendency to diminish those standards of, of respect and esteem and to let certain behaviors or habits slide, to lower your standard for how you are treated, but also how you perceive yourself and how you hold yourself as you move in the world. And if you held yourself in high regard, you might behave and operate slightly differently. or perhaps even quite a bit differently. So 
So just allow anything to come into your awareness right now as you sense this contrast. If you were to truly hold yourself in high regard, what way of being or what behavior, what would change? What would you include that currently isn't a part of your life or what would you exclude that currently is a part of your life? If you were truly to hold yourself in high regard, what would change about your current reality? Whatever insights you have, this is your next step is to implement those shifts. Holding yourself in high regard changes everything, changes your reality. changes what you can have, it changes who you can be, changes your surroundings, changes how others interact with you, what possibilities can actualize. And it's very natural because God holds you in high regard. This is the truth. This is the, the way it's meant to be. Anything less than this is not real. So all that you're doing is you're aligning with the truth from the perspective of, of God of creator itself. You are infinitely loved and protected and guarded and cherished. So it's really just an acknowledgement of the truth of how it's really supposed to be. And you're, you know, shutting out distorted perceptions that don't belong within your field. Hmm. Hmm. And it's much more enjoyable. <laughs> You'll really enjoy holding yourself in high regard and treating yourself very well. So come back. Just take a nice deep breath in. And let it go. 
Hmm. I'm excited. I just, I just recorded a bunch of videos. So this is the last one for today. And as I was receiving that message, I could see how I can hold myself in more high regard and, and mostly just having the expectation that my creations are successful um, and fruitful. And I want to go now and get some pizza. There's a beautiful pizza place on the beach. It's so good. It's an Italian place. And the, the town where I'm living in the Dominican Republic has a lot of French and, and Italian people. So the food is really good. And I want to go to the grocery store and just get some delicious things that I have in mind. So we restock. So that's what I'm going to do now. And um, yeah, make sure you click the notification bell if you haven't already for my channel so that you're notified when I do these channeled messages. And I look forward to seeing you again soon here on my channel. So much love. Bye. Let me know what you're going to do from today's message. How are you going to shift?